I, I, I'm very good. And, and, and we're here on the evening of your festival, so what have you got lined up for us this year? Uh, well, it's actually going to be our busiest festival for a few years, so I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, we've just finished having our Cider Club, which was the first time we've done a festival all that night. Uh -huh. um, because we're really lucky in that we've got uh, Kate from Canada here, and also Kate from well, everybody knows the Cider on us. So we've just had a sort of two hour long talk on Cider around the world and Cider on Green Farm. And uh, now we're probably ready to jump into the festival tomorrow. So we have live music on weekends. Uh, and on su Saturday we have, uh, I think now it's going to be 12 excellent cider makers from the three counties and beyond uh, coming to our festival, selling at their stores and sharing their cider verse as well as our Broom Farm cider on the bar. And so we'll have, you know, uh, three or four hundred people coming through the farm and celebrating cider in its purest form. So we're all really excited about that. And, I mean, this is the 17th year, I think, that we've done the festival. Uh, so, I, I mean, and some people have been coming for most of that as well. Some people were here really in the early days. And uh, our volunteer team, they've been coming here and they, they help make us make it happen every year. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's it. And I think the last one of Cider Club was your new cider. So you must tell us about that. Please. Yeah, so at, at Cider Club, obviously, we taste cider. And at uh, first, we had four wonderful ciders from Kate. Uh, then we had Mr. Oliver's Hot Perry, which is very fascinating. We contrasted that with some of our uh, whiskey barrel perry, uh, which was interesting. Then we had some oat cast garlic to milk. And then finally we had our brand new cider, uh, which is just being released at the festival this weekend, called Raison d'Etre. Um, and Raison d'Etre is uh, our flagship cider coming out now, which I want to use to push cider towards the more premium, higher quality image that I think cider deserves. Uh, so raison d'etre obviously means reason to being in French and it's the best cider that I could find that put into a glass exactly what we're all about at Brain Farm. So it's made from Dabinet and Michelin apples, which are our two most common apples on the farm. Uh, it's been fermented in an oak barrel, which is our very favourite thing to do. And it was pressed in 2016, so now it's had 12 months uh, in the barrel, and, and it's eight, 24 months in the barrel, and we bottled it in July. So it's coming out now, it's quite mature, but uh, it's going to get better and better. And so the really exciting thing I have about this cider is that we're going to keep making this cider. We're going to keep getting Dabinet mentioned in, putting them in an oak barrel, fermenting them, and contrasting them together year on year to really showcase to people that cider is a natural product that has year-to-year -year variation that you can't predict and you can't control and you don't need to control because we can just celebrate everything that goes on in those barrels. That sounds wonderful. So we'll be able to get a bottle this year and then one next year and then just compare that, that's and, the plan. and yeah, enjoy. That's the plan because they're all going to be at different stages of their cycle and some years they'll be better earlier than others and yes. some years the fruit will just be really coming out in a big way yes. other years the barrel will come through more stronger and you know, it's going to be, a, I hope, it's going to be like a 10 year project and it's going to be really interesting and exciting the whole way That's my, that sounds my wonderful goal. and it's in your new glass as well isn't well, it? well it, it, currently it is in my new glass, it doesn't look that fancy but uh, this is the eco cup idea that we had for the festival so obviously everybody is aware of climate change and we want to cut down our plastic use so when people come to our festival they get one glass and they have to hold on to it the whole time uh, and it's just one little thing that we're doing to try and make things better at the festival. Wonderful, so I recommend everyone come along and try your new cider so I think we'll just pan down to lovely Summer. Summer, what do you think? Summer likes it as well. She's posing. Yes. <laughs> so Wassail Albert, here's to a good weekend. Wassail, thank you very much. Cheers.